All right, this is Chris again with you today, and I've got another JAWS video. I'm um, going to show you how to use Spell Checker with Microsoft Word. I'm using version 2010. Um, I have a client um, that I recently have been teaching how to use Spell Checker, and she knows who she is. And I had her create a document and email it to me so I can do a demonstration. For people on YouTube uh, that may need may need the same help. <clears throat> I'm not going to go in real deep depth over it. Just going to give you the basic overview of how to get in there, turn it on, change some stuff, get back out of it. So I have a, a document here. <clears throat> um, so here is I'm on the desktop. I just had a little shortcut on my desktop. I'm going to hit enter on it. Enter. Cancel button to activate risk-based R. Spell checker demonstration. Docs Microsoft Word. Print to edit. Okay. I'll go to the top of the screen with control home. Top of file. So now February 9th, 20th. I'm going to slow this speech way down. 59%. 56, 50, 50, 40, 46%. 43%. 40, 50, 53, 56%. 59%. 62%. Not bad. If I can figure out what I'm doing here. Slower, 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 slower. Okay. Control Alt page down will slow your speed way down. I was turning my volume down for whatever reason. I need to get with the program. <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna go to the top of the screen with Control Home. Okay. Now to activate the spell checker, it's gonna be the F7 key if you if you're in Microsoft Microsoft Word. So <clears throat> you can just count over eight keys on the very top from the left. I already know where mine is, so I'm just gonna press it. F7. F7. Spelling and grammar dialogue. Type and text. Alt plus colon. Not a dictionary. Missouri. M O U S I R R I. Suggestions list box. Mousier. M O U S I E R. So right, what it did right there, it went ahead and showed the misspelled word, which was supposed to be Missouri. There is now. If I tab once. It gave a suggestion, which is Mauser, and that's not what we're wanting. So if I tab one time, this is basically a big dialog box that you can tab through. That's all we're going to basically be doing is just tabbing through. Tab will always take you all the way in a big circle. Just goes, just you can you can just kind of imagine it from up or from uh, you know starting at the top, going to the bottom, and then coming back up to the top, or starting from the left, going all the way to the right, coming back to the left. You'll never get lost if you keep pressing tab. You always come back to a familiar area. So I'll tab once. Tab suggestions list box. Mousier. M O U S I E R. One of three. To move to an item, press the arrow key. So you heard one of three. There's three suggestions. At this point, I can use my down arrow to pick a different choice. Let's see if Missouri is one of them. Mouser, two of three. M O U S E R. Nope. Mouser, three of three. M O U S E R S. No. So in that case, I've got to go back and type it in. So I'll go back up. Mouser, Mouser, one of three. M O U. I hit control to shut him up. Now, if I want to shift tab backwards, that's that's going to move my my focus backwards one item at a time. Just like tab and forward, I'm going to shift tab backwards. Shift tab, type and text, alt plus colon, not a dictionary, Missouri. Eh. Okay, so we heard type and text. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to select this word and type in Missouri. So I'm going to use my left arrow key. I R R I S U O M. Okay, so I'm going to start with M. I'm going to I'm going to select this uh, whole entire. Well, I'm going to select a character at a time. So I'm going to hold down the shift key. I hold down my left shift. I hit my right arrow. M. Selected. You hear it's selected. And I'm going to keep going until I hear that second I. O. So, U. Select. S. So, I. Select. R. Select. R. Selected. I. Selected. Okay. So the whole entire word is selected now. So what I'm going to do is just simply start typing. Because once everything's selected, if you start typing, it repl it takes all everything that's highlighted, takes it out, and it puts in what you type. So. M. I S S O U R I. There we go. Now I'm just going to tab over until I hear a change button. Missouri tab. Undo edit tab. Change button to activate there it is. press space bar. I'll hit my plus space, space bar. Type in text. Alt plus colon. Possible word choice error. There space marker names. T H E R E dot N A M E S. Suggestions list box. Their names. T H E I R space. So there was a discrepancy there with the how how they use the word there. So I'll tab over and I'm just going to go ahead and change it because I'm going to use their suggestion on most of this. Tab, suggestions, list box, their names, T-H-E-I-R, space, N-A-M-E-S, one to one. To so I'll tab again. Press tab, ignore once button, tab, change button to activate, press space, space bar. bar. Space, type and text, alt plus a, comma, use, I, suggestions, list box, and I. Okay, 
I'm going to tab over here and I'm going to hit change this. Tab, suggestions, list box and die, one to one, to move the <coughs> item, press the arrow keys, alt plus n. Tab, ignore once, tab, ignore rule, tab, next sentence button to activate, tab, change button to add space, type in text, alt plus colon, fragment, a space marker, year space marker, and space marker, a space marker, app, suggestions, list box, fragment, consider revising. <clears throat> so this is something that we, we, we don't have to do. It's just saying, hey, this this may not be right. So we might want to revise this. I'll tab. Tab. Suggestions. List box fragment. Consider revising. One to one. To move to an item. Tab. Ignore once button. To add tab. Ignore rule button. To add tab. Next sentence button. To tab. Explain button. To add tab. Check grammar. Check box. So in tab. other words, we don't have a change button here. So I'm going to shift tab backwards, and I'm just going to go to the next sentence. Shift tab. Explain. Shift tab. Next sentence button. To add space. Type in text. Alt plus colon. Capitalization. The T H E. Suggestions. List box. The T H E. So. She's capitalized the here when the should not have been capitalized. Tab, suggestions, list box the one to one. To move so I'm going to go ahead and tab and change it. Tab, ignore once, tab, ignore rule, but tab, next sentence, tab, change button, the space, space. type of text, alt plus colon, extra space between words, that space marker, space marker, A, T, H, A, T, dot, dot, T, H, E, Y, suggestions, list box the A, T, H, A, T, space, T, H, E, Y. So if you notice, there's this, the spell checker really picks up a bunch of mistakes. Just not spelling. Tab suggestions. Lit tab. Ignore once button. Tab. Ignore rule. Tab. Next sentence. But tab. Change button. To add space. Type of text. Change Alt it. plus colon. Type of text. Alt plus colon. Not a dictionary. Rodeo. R O D I O. Suggestions. List okay. box. Rodeo. R O D. So rodeo was spelt wrong, and it. You know. Tab suggestions. List box. Rodeo. R O D E O. One of three. To move okay, to an so item. Press the arrow keys. Alt tab. Ignore once button. Tab. Ignore all tab. Add the diction tab. Change button to activate. Press space. Type space. of text. Alt plus colon. Possible word choice error. Any space marker. Body. A N Y dot. B O D Y. Suggestions. List box. Anybody. A N Y B O D Y. And when you're a JAWS user and you're using the screen reader, I mean it's 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 very easy to have a bunch of mistakes. You know, I mean it can happen very easily. You don't mean to, but it, it does happen. So we'll tab. Tab. Suggestions. List box. Anybody. A N Y B O D Y. One to one. It sounds to an legit. Item. Press the arrow. Tab. Suggestions. Tab. Change button to Change activate. It. Press space. Type of text. Alt plus colon. Capitalization. A A. Suggestions. List box. A. Okay. Tab. tab. Suggestions. List box. A. One to one. To move to a tab. Suggest tab. Ignore rule. Tab. Next set tab. Change button to add space. Type of text. Alt plus colon. Comma use. She. Suggestions. List box. And she. Tab. tab suggestions list box and she one to one tab ignore once button to tab ignore rule button to activate tab next sentence tab change button space type and text alt plus colon extra space between words here space marker space marker and y e a r dot dot a n d suggestions list box here and y e a r space a n d tab Tab suggestions. Tab ignore once. Tab ignore rule button to activate. Press tab. Next sentence button. Tab change button to activate. Press space bar. Alt space. Type in text. Alt plus colon. Repeated word. Maggie. M A G G I E. Suggestions. List box. No spelling. Suggestions. Okay. So, so this is. <clears throat> so they may think uh, and maybe an animal's name might be misspelled or somebody just misspelled or, or, or spelled it just in a weird way or a different way. <clears throat> In this case, she's got two words, or uh, the, the names are, are Maggie Maggie. Um, so I'm going to tab, and you're going to see something that's going to say change, or uh, ignore once. Tab, suggestions, list box suggestions, to move to an item, press the arrow keys, alt plus n. Tab, ignore once button, to activate. So we could just ignore this, I. we could just ignore this, and nothing will happen, because we're just going to ignore it just one time, and like, alright, that's the way that I intentionally wanted it to be. So I can just hit that space bar. Space, type of text, alt plus colon, extra space between words, black space marker, space marker, and B L A C K dot, dot, A N D, suggestions, list box, black and B L A C K space, A N D. So it's nice that it can pick up, you know, extra spaces. So tab again. Tab, suggestion, tab, ignore once button, tab, ignore rule, tab, next sentence button, tab, change button, space, spell checker demonstration, docs, Microsoft Word, Microsoft Word dialog, the spelling and grammar check is complete, okay button to activate. Okay. So it's all done, bar. I hit the space bar just because it just let me know that it's done. Space, print view, edit. Now I'm going to read the whole, I'm going to go to the top, control home of the document. Now I'm going to hit the, I'm going to read it all and I'm going to put it, I'm going to use JAWS down arrow. That's the say all command. It will read from wherever your cursor is to the end of your document with JAWS down arrow. And if you're not sure what your JAWS key is, some people refer to it as an insert key, or it's the zero on the number pad if your numpad is turned off. Savannah, February 9th, 2017. Hi, my name is Savannah. I am from Tipton, Missouri, and I have about 7,000 cats. Their names are as follows. Brittany, Maggie, Casey, Amber. All of them are over a year and a half. The things that they can do are as follows. One. 
Casey is a rodeo cat. She is a wild cat, and she hardly will let anybody touch her. Two. Brittany is a cat over a year and a half, but she's gentle and misleady. Three. Maggie. Maggie is a red and black, and she is gentle. Four. All of the calves and cows can get around in the pasture really well. That's it. That's all it was. And it sounds that doesn't sound too bad now. Um, I should have let you guys heard it before, which it wasn't too noticeably different because we did a, it caught a lot of extra periods, a lot of the spacing, and sometimes. I've noticed that when, when you have to use a screen reader, JAWS users are not, <clears throat> they tend to not be the best of spellers. And what they do is they try to, they try to make JAWS say it the best, that, you know, they, they, what they do is they try to, like, that sounds good. I can't, you know, she spelled Missouri in a weird way. However, however you, you know, you really have to have a trained ear in order to pick up that it was misspelled. Uh, I'm going to close this. And then I'm going to go ahead and let you hear. I'm not going to save this. And I'm going to let you listen to what it was before I messed with the editing. Or, I mean, I'm sorry, the spell checker. So I'm going to go ahead and Alt F4. Alt F4. Microsoft Word. Microsoft Word. Do save I want button. to? No, I want to save. No, I will tab. Tab. Don't save button. Space, space bar. Okay. I'm going to go back to my desktop here. Windows D. Desktop. Folder. View. List. View. Spell checker. Demonstration. Dot shortcut. Four. Okay, I'm gonna slow it down. Control Alt page down. Slower, 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 slower. There we go. Enter, Enter. open it up. Spell checker demonstration. Docs Microsoft Word. Oh, okay. Now that I'm in here, I the Alt Control page down or page up will only temporarily speed it up or slow it down. If you change screens, it reverts back to what it was originally before you messed with it. Slower, 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 slower. Go back to the top. top. File. So, manifest. so now I'm gonna go ahead and do Jaws down arrow to read the whole entire document. Savannah, February 9th, 2017. Hi, my name is Savannah. I am from Tipton, Missouri. I have about seven cows and calves. Their names are as follows. Brittany, Maggie, Casey, Amber. All of them are over a year and a half. The things that they can do are as follows. One, Casey is a rodeo calf. She is a wild calf. She hardly will let anybody touch her. Two, Brittany is a cat over a year and a half, but she's gentle and a sleazy. Three, Maggie, Maggie is a red and black, and she is gentle. Four, all of the calves and cows can get around in the pasture really well. Now, if you have a really trained ear, you can see some, you would definitely know some differences between this version and the spell checked version so uh, that's gonna conclude this little short video of how to use the spell checker um, it's basically the same in 2013 and 16 uh, I like I said I'm just currently have 2010 up and running so that's what I went with um, I will see if we can get another video out as soon as I can uh, thank you for watching